Welcome back everybody to another workout with Zenefit. Today we are working solely on the abdominals. We have got 10 minutes of a made up ab workout. So I've got nothing written down. I'm just gonna go from exercise to exercise to exercise. And we're gonna really, really try and work this midsection as hard as we can in just 10 minutes, okay? So you can add this onto another workout if you want. So I've just been for a run, hence why I'm a sweaty mess. I'm gonna add this as a second phase of my workout. Or you can repeat it twice, three times, whatever on the hell you wanna do really, okay? so. Without further ado, make sure you have a little bit of water just to hydrate during this. Lovely jubbly. And make sure you are ready to rock and roll. So we're going to do leg raises to start with. So have a lie down on the floor. I'm going to start my timer. And we're going to go for 50 seconds of leg raises. In three, two, one, let's get going. So nice and steady, control up, control down. So we'll just smash 10 minutes of this. That's going to be a really good little ab circuit done. So we'll try and get the movements in a good kind of order so we work the abs in as many different ways from as many different angles as possible so just 10 minutes to so stick with me let's make sure every rep is good quality 20 seconds left on this one and like i said you can add this to a as a second phase of a workout or you can just repeat it a couple of times if you're just doing abs that day and we've got five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, 10 second breather, we're gonna flip over and we're gonna go for 50 seconds of slow mountain climbers. So press a position, bring that knee forward, bring that knee forward, keeping that belly button tucked in tight. And off we go. Good, really squeeze the abs. Well done, good job, good job. Make sure you're breathing, don't hold your breath, okay? Good, abs come down, abs come forward, knee comes, comes forward. Can't speak properly today. Okay, we've got 20 seconds left. Good. And last 10. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna flip it over and we're gonna go forward to just normal sit-ups. Okay, so hands are gonna come over the head, interlink your fingers. We're gonna sit up, trying to keep those hands as high as we can. And off we go. So we're up, keep those hands up high, control down. So we wanna make sure your spine is each vertebra is coming down to the floor and each vertebra is peeling off the floor one at a time. So we're rolling up. Rolling down, nice and smooth. Good. Squeeze up, squeeze down, nice job. 25 to go, and we're up. If you wanna make it a bit more difficult, you can hold a kettlebell or a dumbbell or a slam ball, medicine ball, whatever. Just give yourself a little bit more resistance. Good. And we've got five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna flip it over. We're gonna get into a plank position. We're gonna pulse those hips up and down. And three, two, one, here we go. So hips go down, hips go up. Well done. Again, make sure you're breathing. Control the movement, start to feel this now. Good work, okay, we've got 20 seconds left. And we've got 10 to go. Five, four, three, two, and one, great job. Okay, flip it over. We're gonna go for a single leg crunch this time. So it's gonna be right to left. So my right arm's gonna come up, touch my left shin, and we're gonna repeat in three, two, one. Here we go. Good. Well done. 
going to go for five more seconds this side, then we'll switch it. Three, two, and switch it up. Let's go. Good work. Come on, we got this. We're halfway through after this one. Good. Got 10 more seconds, going to get back into a plank position. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, so we're up. Plank position this time, we're going to drop the hips either side. So it's a little hip drop. So we're in plank, drop the hips down one side, up, other side, and up. Okay, and let's go. So we're down, can hit the obliques up to the middle. You almost want to stick your bum in the air a bit as you come up, okay? Good, and you should feel this along the side of your tummy. Nice work. Okay, we've got 20 left, 20 seconds to go. Good, 10 more. Five, three, two, and one. Fantastic, okay, we flip it over. We're gonna go for a bicycle crunch, but it's gonna be foot on the floor, we come up, meet in the middle, and rotate, and switch. And three, two, one, let's go. So you're gonna meet the opposite knee. Good. Nice work, well done. Keep his tempo going, keep lifting those shoulders. Good, really hitting his abs hard here. Can feel this. Big time. Twenty more seconds. And ten. And five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Okay. Next up, we're going to go for toe touches. So legs in the air, and three, two, one, let's go. So we come up, all the way down. So arms overhead, squeeze up, all the way down, good. Last three minutes here. Good. Come on, let's keep this going. Abs are on fire, absolute fire. 20 seconds left. Ugh. 15. And we've got five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna get into Russian twists in a second. Oh, I can feel this so much. Good. And three, two, one, let's go. So you can keep your feet on the floor or take your feet off the floor. Don't really mind, it depends how your hip flexors are holding up at the minute. If I want a full rotation on hands to hit the floor, make sure we're leaning back so we've got a good angle on that torso so we're activating the abs all the way through to the obliques. 25 left. Come on, we got this. 20 to go. We're going to finish off with a V crunch, okay? So that's both arms and legs folding in half. Good, we've got 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, and one. Amazing. Shake them off. Okay, so we're going to lie down flat. We're going to fold in half. And we're starting in five. Four, three, two, and one, and let's go. So we're up, control down. Come on, last 50 seconds, and that's workout done. Unless you're going to repeat it, then good luck to you. Uh, 
Good, okay, we've got 25 to go. Well done, keep it going. 10 more seconds. And five, four, three, two, one for luck, and relax. There. Oh, awesome guys, so that is a workout done. Just goes to show you, you can kind of make it up on the spot. You don't have to have a plan in place. You set yourself a certain amount of time, and then if you've got enough of a knowledge of exercises, different exercises to, exercises to do for that body part, then just go for it, okay? It does spice things up, it does make you think about it, and it actually makes the time go really fast. So hopefully you've enjoyed this, guys. Like I say, you can add this to another workout, or you can repeat it a few times, up to you. Make sure you're staying hydrated, make sure you have a stretch off if this is at the end of a workout. And guys, keep eating loads of loads of good food, healthy, nutritious foods to keep us as happy and as active as we possibly can at this moment in time. So thank you again for watching. Please share this with friends, family, loved ones. Get the word about it. Get everyone as active as possible. But have a great day, guys. Stay safe. Stay strong. See you on the next video.